Hi, I'm Nick, and congratulations on joining the McCafe team in your restaurant. You'll be responsible for creating our customers' brilliant espresso coffee and their outstanding McCafe experience. You're the face of McCafe. Thanks, Nick. McCafe was conceived and developed in Australia and has since spread to New Zealand and right throughout the McDonald's world. The McCafe menu offers a range of hot and cold coffee-based beverages and a delicious range of foods. Today you'll learn everything about the cafe. Not just operational procedures, but knowledge and skills you need to be an efficient McCafe member who gives customers great QSC on every shift. One legend has it that Kaldi the goat herd discovered coffee in Ethiopia. The word spread far and wide, eventually reaching Europe. The first coffee houses sprung up in Italy, spread through Europe, and the world has never looked back. Coffee is grown commercially from two beans, Arabica and Robusta. Arabica beans produce higher quality gourmet coffee. So of course, our McCafe blend is an exclusive mix of the best. Three 100% Arabica beans, producing a mild blend. It's a distinctive, smooth and well-rounded coffee with a pleasant aroma and appeals to a wide range of customers. Vast plantations produce red coffee cherries from a coffee tree. Each fruit is individually picked, then processed. The skin and pulp is removed and only the best beans are selected for the McCafe Arabica blend. Then they check and grade the beans again before they pack them. McCafe beans are roasted, cooled, and quality tested to our specifications of color, flavor, and aroma. Finally, they're packed and delivered to your restaurant. It's quite a process to make McCafe beans so perfect. Coffee drinkers are usually quite picky, often demanding, and sometimes even obsessed about their daily cup but get it right and they're very loyal. The art of espresso has three elements, 25% coffee bean, 25% equipment, and 50% you, the barista. The coffee bean influences 25% of a coffee's overall taste, so it must be well looked after like any food. Equally, the equipment counts for 25%. The espresso machine is the heart of your McCafe. It's crucial that your espresso machine is well cleaned and maintained and the settings are correct. The coffee machine in your McCafe may look a little different, but the principles are the same. But the McCafe barista is the big one. You count for half the overall quality of the coffee served to your customers. Follow every operational procedure, add some passion, and you'll be able to deliver on our quality goal. You need to know the basic terms or the language of coffee. A barista is someone trained in the art of coffee. How coarse or fine the beans are ground is the grind, and it's a big factor in a perfect espresso. Extraction is the espresso method of making coffee, where the hot water is pushed through the beans. All beans start out green, and then roasted light, medium or dark dark being the strongest roast. Fragrance refers to the smell of the roasted beans, whereas aroma is what you smell during the extraction process. Crema is the dense golden liquid on top of the espresso base that's an indication of a good quality espresso. Body is the richness of the coffee's underlying taste and the coffee experience in the mouth. 
A full body coffee has a rich texture and heaviness on the tongue with a taste that lingers. Acidity creates the pleasingly crisp, sharp taste of coffee. So where do you start? As with every shift, make sure you are prepared to deliver an outstanding the cafe experience through exceptional quality, service and cleanliness every time. But there are a few basic things that you'll need to know about working in the cafe. By now your crew trainer would have trained and verified you on the station prerequisites before being trained in McCafe. If you haven't covered the basics, speak to your crew trainer or manager. When you started your employment, you received an employee handbook covering your employment at McDonald's. Make sure you've seen an orientation video or DVD and been verified on the restaurant basics checklist. And you must be trained and verified on customer delight basics before serving McCafe customers. The first piece of training material you receive is the introduction to McCafe Flyer, with some background and basics on McCafe and the coffee industry. The McCafe Crew Development Program has all the McCafe operational procedure sheets, known as OPSs. They contain critical information on how to perform each procedure to prepare McCafe food and beverage products. Always use the latest version of McCafe OPS. McCafe Station Observation Checklists, or SOCs, a verification tools used to confirm that you are competent at all McCafe procedures and station responsibilities. The open and close SOCs also double as checklists for you to use on an opening or a closing shift. 